What's going on, everybody? My name's Chris, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker HD Visually Blind in Hero Mode. Yes, I guess it's an actual real thing I'm going to be saying now. <laughs> um, in the last episode, is there a freaking ball right beside my ship? Is that what I'm seeing right now? I guess not. I guess I'm just being crazy. <laughs> in the last episode, we got boots. Yeah, look at those iron boot skis. Look at the boot skis. Oh god, bring tell Randall's wearing off of me with his skis, he says, after pretty much everything. <laughs> uh, and last, yeah, we got the iron boots from Ice Spring Isle, and now, we're gonna be going to Fire Mountain, which is this square right south of Dragon Blue style in Nova. Yeah. I wish you could place, like, personal markers or something, that'd be cool, like, you know, Skyrim and probably other games. I think we've done Skyrim, right? I've never played it. I'm scared to play that game, because honestly, I know if I did play it, I'd probably get so sucked into it. Oh god, god forgive. Or something. I don't know, so in this episode... Must get... Uh, uh, oh, for some reason I thought there'd be a letter in there, but nope. Uh, we need to figure out which way we're going again, because I freaking forget. Alright, we're going the complete opposite way. Uh, is it that island over there? It appears to be so. Okay. You know, I should be using my gamepad more here. I mean, I have a gamepad right in front of me. I'm using the Pro Controller, if you didn't already know. But, I can also have the gamepad on at the same time. While I can't really use it functionally, what I can do is I can use it as a map and all that. All hail Link, the God of Light! Hmm. From the Earth Temple from Lamar. Well then, interesting. Seems like Link had to change of clothes there. Which actually, by the way, we won't have access to in this because the only way you get that is if you beat the game. I don't know what's about over there. Screw it. I don't care. Whatever. Whatevs. Punk. <laughs> okay. So. Fire out, good lord. So what happens if I try to gain access to this island? Okay. Yep. That hurts me alright. <laughs> Alrighty then. So. Let's take out our arrows. Is that gonna work? Oh no. You know what? We got oh, good lord. Oh, good lord. Uh, um, um, ow. Um. Can I, can I pull up my grappling hook? That'd be freaking fantastic, to be fair. Alright, I'm gonna put this on. Oh, I can't even do that. Great. Uh, put on items. Alright, uh, uh, uh. No! No, that's not how I want to use it! I forgot that was a thing! Why can't I walk onto you, woman? I don't know why you're a woman for. You can seriously be a guy. It's, I can't do anything! <laughs> there we go! Jeez! Let me guess. It's gonna spawn a feather onto the lap. No, it's not. Interesting. Wow, that was a pain in my bumble. All right, freeze that giant column of lava, and it all the rest of the lava just kind of disappears. It doesn't even like flow off. It just disappears. oh, cool! I forgot that explode. That's awesome. Uh, wow, and the nice sunset thing. And once again, we got five minutes. A bit scary to look at, but honestly, you'll be. Fu oh, oops. Yeah, I did not mean talking. I thought you automatically talked to me for a second. I'm like, what is he saying? What is these words he is saying to me? I honestly like exploring this island more than uh, the Ice Spring Isle. It's just a lot more fun to me. I mean, ice physics, for one, are not here. <laughs> That's probably the main reason why I like this place better. You just lead me into a big circle. You just led me into a big circle jerk. Am I missing something here? Oh, I see. Gotta climb up this, this way. So, once again, I waste 30 seconds. Which, I mean, it's kind of scary to me, but they do give you a lot of time. I also feel like it should give me a lot less time. Just so you know, I'm making more of a challenge. I'm almost curious what would happen if I purposely stay here. Oh, this is a bit of a maze, isn't it? Oh, that leads to nothing. I don't know, this island's a lot more fun to traverse to me. Climbing a giant mountain? Heck yes! Going along freaking ice physics? Heck no. It's this way. I almost feel like going the other way would be like a red herring. What the balls? Are you serious? You gotta deal with that asshole? Wow, that was a pro jump right there. I see that crap? Don't you dare hit me, asshole. Alright, well, this seemed to lead to the same spot anyways. You know, I did have to make a pro jump. Pro ski jump, I almost said. <laughs> uh, we're gonna... Oh, see that bomb behind us? Oh, good lord. The wind's requiem. That's the first time we've casted that, apparently. Yep, well, it's the was already going the right way, but no, it wasn't just going completely the wrong way. I forget, it always starts you off on the north for some reason. The compass that is. Alright, we don't need the skull hammer for anything. But I don't feel like we. Whoa, we use the skull hammer for very much in this game. That's probably why I don't really like it that much. Well, I mean, it's not a very good weapon. Just because, you know, it takes so long to swing. So very long. 
And because of that, it makes it a bit kind of difficult to use as like a normal weapon. And then there's not really like any... Alright, you want to be careful here because you step off this, I believe. Oh no, I guess it doesn't. Because nothing pops up there. Let's go this way. That's my giant stone. And I'm not going to bomb it because bombing it does nothing. So we're going to ignore it for now. Hey, look! Some already placed water pots on here, like in Dragon Roost Island. Thank the Lloyd. Uh, whoa! Did that just sink? What just happened there? Oh, you know what just happened? Oh, I'm getting out of here. I know what just happened. Ah, jeez! I hate you guys! I hate you! Get over here! Good. You deserve what you got. Alright, we're gonna swap that to normal arrows. So otherwise, they're gonna screw us over again. I think the the ice hit the platform though. Seriously, dude, it's just, just oh no, they just naturally sink after you stand on them long. Oh, I see. No, they don't. They just sink if you. They just there's a lot of timer. As soon as you step on them, they start sinking. Okay, we need to stop wasting our hearts here. Let's just go. Just need to go. Just ignore all the things apparently. Okay, right, what would happen if I like this? Oh no. I swapped one too many times. More fire keys, there's not. Alright, I really want to see. It just, it doesn't, what? That should totally just kill him. Should just, ooh, kill him. Can we use that on him once they're frozen? Oh. Oh, we actually did damage in there. Wow. That kind of sucked. Eh. Oh, you know what? I could have instantly killed him there if I reacted better. Well, oh well. We have plenty of time to show that off. In the Savage Labyrinth. What is that you might be asking? Well, I'll just let you figure that out on your own. Uh, for those that know though, oh, oh, I'm terrified to do that in hero mode. Very terrified indeed. However, thing is, I mean, I'm taking a lot of damage in here. You got the power bracelets. Both arms are now stronger than ever. Press A to grab and lift objects. Oh great, more fire keys. Sorry, I just decided to take a giant sip of my giant two liter of root beer that I got last night, even though I haven't drank any of it yet. <laughs> All right, this giant stone. But yeah, I'm not too afraid of the savage labyrinth. What's up? My name is Link, and I'm going to stand and lift, 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 lift. Okay, we're done here. That was really dumb. You know, sometimes jokes just don't go too well for me. Yeah, cause when I'm like just fighting these guys, I'm taking a lot of hearts of damage just because I'm just being stupid, and I'm not really like trying my hardest to not take damage. That's why I kind of feel like in places like the Sav Savage Labyrinth, I'll be on my toes. I'll be trying my absolute best not to take any damage at all. And that's why I'm kind of not too concerned with it. Is there oh, there's another fire keys over there. I kind of feel like I have to kill all the things, man. Oh, I almost walked to the lava. Wait, actually, what happened if I use that? Oh, man. All right. Oh, that would have been amazing. Damn. Come on. Into my line to say, okay, he flies in a big circle. Dude, you just like jumped in. Oh, whatever, screw you. You know what? Fine. There's no more keys in here. You can't reproduce. Look, he's even flying back there. He's like, wait, I'll come with you. But he can't. The clock's back. So you see, on each of these islands, you just are you gonna ever fly towards? Are you gonna try to attack me, woman? Once again, don't know why, woman. Hey, look. There we go. Yes. All right, just let go, just let go, whatever. We don't need a fighter. Did I take damage from that? I don't know. I took an entire heart of damage from her. That sucks, mate. Oh, man, we're pretty low on health here. That's okay, we have a fairy. And actually, we're about to go back um, to get more fairy. We're gonna go do great fairies for the rest of this episode. <laughs> or at least until I run out of things to do. Um, all right, Windfall Islands. First fairy we're going to, and I actually have a list here. Uh, is on C1. In square C1. Yep, that's right. With the letters going the top of the grid and the numbers going along the side. That's what I'm doing it, which is kind of weird. For some reason, I always think it's the other way. Like, letters go along the side. Here, I'll even pull this up here. I always think letters go, like, on this side of the map. God dang it. Ugh, freaking. I'm just going to use my D pad for this because it's a lot more technical for that kind of stuff. So, I always think, like, letters go on this side and that numbers go on this side for some reason, like, along the top. But no, apparently, no one does that. And I'm just crazy, crazy. This is the correct way. Yes, yes it is. Awesome. Uh, so it looks like it's right there, actually. So let's go to it. 
almost kind of sad we're not going to go to like the Forsaken Fortress. Island. We're going to be so close to it, but whatever. Also, it's kind of terrifying how Windfall Island is like pretty dang close to the Forsaken Fortress. That is pretty scary. Like if Gan wanted to attack, he could be there in just like a few days. Like how, why, why is he not taking over Windfall Island? That's like the one place that would maybe like be able to stop him. Because it's like, you know, the one major city in this game. You know, maybe Dragon Roost Island would be pretty good too. You know what? That's why he has an attack, because he knows Dragon Roost Island would come to their aid and completely destroy him. Alright, let's pull out our bait here. Actually, we don't need to, because we could just use our gamepad. Oh, look at that. Oh, dang it. <laughs> I'm so smart, guys. I use bait in my gamepad, and then I just decided to jump out of my ship. Still not used to the button combinations in this game, which is weird, 40 episodes in. Holy small fry! Yeah, I'm open up my sleep chart. All right, now while he's doing this, I'm going to look at where the next one's going to be. Hmm, eighth? Oh, we're at A3. Oh, wait a minute. Which one? Oh. Oh. Okay, we're on A3. Oh, dang it. He calls magic armor. He's talking about the freaking windfall. And I missed the first part, though. He calls a magic armor or something like that. That's cool. Pretty, it's pretty cool. Magical relic, from what I've heard. If you want to... If you want him to give it to you, Chas staring deep into his hands, eyes and winning him over with Waterly Fry. <laughs> that's what I've got to offer. Great joke. I like how that's not even a hint. It's like often in games are like, ha, oh, you should try doing this, ha ha ha. And then it turns out that's the thing you have to do. Not in this game. Just seriously, he's just like, try doing that. I can't believe you believe me. Ha ha ha. Is there? I thought I saw it. Oh, there's a mailbox here. Very interesting. Ooh, should I do this as well? Ho oh, oh, ho, so that's how it works. What? That's how what works. What? Hello? Dun dun dun! So yeah, once again, when you see this guy with the red eye, because he's been staring out into the ocean so that's actually pretty scary looking. Oh, oh, he actually has an eye under that telescope. Cool. There's a glitch into it. <laughs> but, um, yeah, whenever you see him, he is looking at something pretty vital out into the ocean. Right, let's go to the second great fairy here and get an upgrade. I think I should at least get these upgrades. That'll help me out in the future temples here. She's pink. How very lovely. Young waker of the winds. Allow me to aid you in your quest. Allow me to give you aids in your quest. Many aids. <gasps> it's a beautiful flower. And with that, you can now carry more rupees, and I can hold up to five thousand rupees. The phrase and found show easier wariness. Cool beans. But she already healed me, so there's no point. <laughs> I do have both my fairies. Yes, I do. Great. So yeah, that's the final uh, wallet upgrade in the game. Very interesting now, isn't it? Yes, it is. Alright, next one we're going to be wanting to go to is... Wait, what? A3. So that's two squares south if you're ting... What? A, B, C... Wait, no. A3, you stoop. So that'll be this one. Jeez. Where's mother and child... Just tingle. Okay, but we could go to Great Fish Isle. So, yeah, we'll go to Great Fish Isle here. And then we'll sail uh, one square northwest. Wait, yeah, northwest. I was going to mix up to north and east. I have to always think about that. I don't, I don't ever be like, oh, no, which direction is it? I don't remember. But I always take a second to be like, what, which way is that again? I guess we also go to Tingle. I don't know where it is positioned with everything else, though. So let's just go to Great Fish Isle. So northwest. Northwest. Ooh, actually, this will be the first time we'll be at Great Fish Owl when it's not in terrible cursed form. <laughs> Unless it's already raining. Oh, it is nighttime, though. But yeah, you can actually go there during the day now. And, well, it still is a terribly destroyed island. I'm sure millions of people died. But hey, at least it's not raining anymore. Yay! Oh, boy. This place is a wreck. It's horrible. It's disgusting. And we're going to leave it now. Oh, it's such a cool place. I really do like that, though. I really do enjoy the fact that probably thousands of people are dead. Uh, <laughs> just kidding. Um, okay. Let's go to this next feral island here. Gotta say, still not entirely sure how I feel about this sale. <laughs> I hate it, but I love it. I love to hate it. 
Let's face it. Another bottle over there. Not going to go for it. <clears throat> Come on, Fairy Island. Look at those watch stars. One complaint I still have in these games is like things when they load in. It's like, it, that, that's way too obvious. What is that glowy glow over there? I don't know what that glowy glow is. I almost... I almost got so distracted by that, and I almost didn't go for the fishy fish. The flushy foosh. Eh, oh, I know what it is. Did he see it? Did he see it? He saw it. Alrighty, then. So what do you guys say about this island, Mr. Fish Guy? Mr. Man Fish? Uh-huh. My sea chart is open. You draw it. You draw it. Western Fairy Islands. What you got? What you got? I heard that bird people who live on Dragon Roost east of here have invented a incredibly useful device they call the grappling hook. No lie, Fry! They can throw that thing at monsters and use the grab treasure they've hidden in their pockets. Talk about cool. Oh, and you've seen those imp-like creatures called Bokoblins that hang out on the lookout platforms that see and stare at their, their telescopes? I hear those guys keep joy pendants hidden in their pockets. So if you use one of those grappling hooks, they use it to swipe their pendants. Yeah, so all obvious info. I mean, I don't think you can even come to this island until after you got the grappling hook. I don't, in fact, I'm pretty sure. What is that place over there? A great fish isle? No, it's not. Oh. Yeah, it's an island I haven't been to. It looks like a giant tree over there, doesn't it? Get a better look at that. Oh. There's also those salvage clip guys as well. By the way, after you get the skull hammer, that's when you can get uh, access to every single one of the fairy islands in the game. Some of them you need arrows for. I was like, what is that for a second? It's an odd place for a tangle bottle. Remember, they're like along the shore, but not this time. Um, some of them you need bombs. Some of them you need the skull hammer. And... What else is it? Oh, wait, some of them are just already open, I think? Is there, any, is there any others you need? I don't know. All right, let's go inside. Okay, so... The ones with the skull hammer, actually... They're always going to be... Well, actually, I'll talk about the bomb one first until we get this. Once with the bombs are always going to be like wallet upgrades or more bomb upgrades just because you know they can't give you a bomb upgrade till they know you have bombs in the game young waker of the winds let me to aid you in your quest and stuff i guess <laughs> and stuff i guess oh excuse me thank you <laughs> you can now carry more arrows get up to 60 wherever you go the phrase the found show easier wearing this and stuff Thanks, Bob. I, like I love how Link always gets kind of scared when she explodes. He was like, jumps back. He's like, no! There's a cool enemy. It goes down and up a lot. Thorn for, <laughs> for Bob. God dang it, Bob. I guess he's talking about the blue chews. Alrighty. Now we're going to need to go east to E3. So we're going to that island right there, actually. Yeah. Uh, so we're already at the three square. A, B, C, D, E. Or to just to the west of Western Fairy Island, apparently. Is that right, then? A, B, C, D, E. Really? There's two fairy islands beside each other? That seems a bit weird to me, but okay. Um, Mr. Boat, do you have anything to add to this? No? Okay. Oh, he's yawning. He clearly hates me. Alright. Uh, where is it again? I guess, it, I guess the quickest way would be... I guess God's Tower. We're up there. I know it's gonna put us like not inside, but like in like the ring of it. You guys will see what I'm talking about in a second there. Oh look at those crazy spikes on that shell. The seashell. Jesus giant snail. Not only not only was it a giant snail. Oh, never mind. I thought it would put us like in this inner ring there. Apparently not. Alright, we wanna go south. Wrong way. Look at my gamepad. Oh yeah, agent. No wait, 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 we wanna go north, don't we? Wait, we want to go north. That's right. I'm being silly. I'm feel a theory. All right. Um, I think it's gonna be that one right there. Oh, actually, that might be the wrong. Oh yeah, look, you can see, you can totally see both the islands just right now. Wow, that's kind of weird, but okay, game. <laughs> that's really weird. You can see both the fairy islands. Like, wow, that's strange. But okay, I ain't judging except for the fact that I am judging. Can spread them out a little more. It's crazy how fast you go. Jeez, mate. Look, we could get a treasure chest here. I'm surprised I haven't seen more of those. I mean, we don't have. Uh, 
Uh, never mind. I was going to say, we'll go get that guy in a second, but no, we should get him before I forget about him. Alright. Uh, more baits, please, I guess. Should probably stop. Oh, I'm actually just running low. Please see that. Thank God. <laughs> I didn't think he was going to see that at all for a second there. Alrighty. Hoi, God! Or small fry? Yeah, yeah, right on my... How well can he write when he jumps and with his mouth? He's a fairy isle. Is that a triangle island or something? Word is! They just said word. Word! They hold an auction every night on the Windfall Island. Every night people uh, gather in the Hall of the Wealth to amuse themselves by spending a little money. Ah, they're rich. Yeah, they're rich. Auctions may be a breeze to see who can bid the highest, but I'll let you in on a little secret. The key to winning an auction is to be both patient and bold. I'm serious, Fry. Uh, from what I hear, they get some great things in the auction block, too. Uh, like an extra fast sale, among other things. Maybe that's just a rumor. Let's try it out, small Fry. You might just like it. And that's all the info I've got to offer. Okay. Bye. Oh, no. I pressed A too many times. And yeah, look at the sale. It actually changes. The quick sale changes. Ooh, looks like there's a rock we'll blow it up with. Whatever shall we blow it up with? Hammer, I need your help. I keep looking at those mailboxes, thinking there's going to be things. Like, Why is there even a mailbox here? There's very clearly nothing on this island. I was wondering what that bright light was. <laughs> I think it's thunder, though. Or lightning, I guess. Yeah, because thunder is bright, right? <laughs> oh, dang it. I'm used to an alchemy of time, where if, you, if you're running while holding a bomb... Yeah, if you're running and holding a bomb, that's what throws it. But if you're, like, still and place, that's when you place it. But no. Oh, we're going to blow up with poor little Korok. Sorry, Korok. Totally just might have killed your tree. Okay. <laughs> Alrighty. Let's go over here. Yay! <laughs> Young Waker of the Winds. I'll aid you in my quest. Or something. <laughs> Alright, we just have one more island to go to here. This episode is starting to get a bit long, though. Okay, more bombs. 99. Fairies and Fallon show easy when you become fatigued and stuff. My shield has a very odd symbol on it. It just looks like there's like a Satan-looking guy on there. It's really creepy, actually. I'm pretty scared. Alright, uh, the next one is on. The last one we'll be doing is G4. After that, there is one more great fairy. However, we don't have access. Well, we do have access to it, but we're, you have to do something different to get to that one. So I won't be doing that one for now. Um, G4, where is that going to be? Uh, let's see. A, B, C, D, E, F, G. One, or two, three, four. A little there. Two east of um, the God's Tower, right? I think that's what it... Oh man, I guess the quickest way would probably be the God's Tower and just go east from there. So what if I just meet you guys there so I don't have to sail there? Sail! Even, you know what, even if we do see an island, I'm just gonna skip over it and not talk to the map fish or whatever, just because we don't have any time or whatever. Yeah, look, there's a bottle right there. Too bad, bottle! I have no time for the likes of you! Oh look, we're not gonna be skipping over the square. Well, I mean, we will. It won't be too big of a deal because we've already got. I can't believe the sale needs to go twice as fast. It's so crazy. It's really crazy to me. Alright, so we're looking for it. That might be it over there. No, that's that's not right. Where are you? Is that it? Is this a triangle island? This might be a triangle island right here. But indeed it is in this salvage corp. Another beam of light. Oh, I think that's that's got to be it over there. Over yonder. Alrighty. Right? Yeah, that's got to be it. Right. I'm sorry for the long episode, you guys. It's almost 25 minutes long. Man, I am. I was kind of aiming to make this entire Let's Play. Like, I normally aim to go 15 to 20 minutes in like most of my Let's Plays, but for Zelda games. I just noticed it takes forever if you do that much, and, or if you only do 20 minute episodes, 15 to 20 minutes. So unless I get like a really good point to stop, 
at 15 minutes. What are those guys doing? Those, those sea cats are just kind of in the middle of nowhere. But then also, they're just... It'll take too long. Oh, I'm just speedrunning tacticing this. Speed throwing bait for this fish. <laughs> Boy, it's my fry. I'm skipping text and stuff. Alright. I don't know what this guy's going to give me. Um, I do have a list of all the fairy islands here, but the thing is, I never put the squares, I just put the names of the islands. Tell me, small fry, do you have any golden feathers? Here, those things are all the rage with the weedle la ladies on Dragon Roost Islands these days. Let's just go gaga over them. Lady Gaga, in fact. But the thing is, the only way to, to get a golden feather is to defeat one of those bird monsters, or so they say. Yep, real men have girlfriends, sure have tough losses in their life. That's a lame I read that wrong, but, you know. <laughs> Tough losts in their life. Yep, that is exactly what you said. Alright. Go, go, go! I don't know what that island in the middle of there is about. I don't know if that's... Or not in the middle, off to the side. Is there a hole there? I don't see no hole. Oh boy, of course you gotta give me... Well, not a complicated puzzle. For a puzzle, that's gonna take some time here. Ah, it's so far away! Skull hammer! Why must ye be so far away? Bam. And bam. Yay! Alright. Let's go to the she shells, she shells by the seashore. Oh jeez, man. 26 minutes. Maybe even more or less, depending on stuff. You know, let's pull like a pitfall. The last expedition where I could only have my videos be a certain time and I like would fast forward the entire video by a little bit. Young Waker of the Winds, allow me to aid you in your quest. And that's the second last time you'll ever see that in this game, you guys. This is like, all, that's not actually feathers, it's just all her spit. You know, carry more arrows, carry up to 99 wherever you go. Face and fountain shall ease your weariness. Come here to be a fish. Boy! Kind of think of it though, this will be the last time you'll see a fairy fountain. Like a proper fairy fountain, so. Bye! <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like and subscribe when you're ready. My name's Chris. Uh, I'm not entirely sure what we're gonna do the next episode. Maybe we will start the next temple. Or maybe we'll look for more heart pieces or something. I mean, either way, we probably should get more hearts, to be fair. But, you know. We're starting to fill out our map quite a bit, though. Alright, take you guys later. Bye bye I'm not going to let that hit me. Where did the bomb even go? Oh, good lord! Alright, see you guys!